Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Mega Constructs Halo Warthog Rally from 2020. This is recommended for people 8 years or older. It has 314 pieces. It comes with a Warthog, two UNSC, and when I say that, you know, I just mean Master Chief and the Marine, and then two Jackal Freebooters. And so, pretty much, you know, it's got a two-in-one feature where you can build something else with it if you wanted to. The boat and a jetpack. But I don't really like to do that, so I'm not going to do that in this video. Or at all. I don't think I will. And, um, it comes with two plasma pistols, one SMG, and one assault rifle. And I'm going to tell you something about the assault rifle in a minute. Trust me, it's, I don't know. It kind of surprised me. I, it, it just interests me a lot. And um, there's this other set that goes really well with it. You know, it's the Recon Escape. Pretty sure that's what it's called. Comes with two Marines, a Mongoose, uh, one Grunt, and one Elite. That's the only reason I bought that one instead of a, another Warthog Rally. Just because of the variety of figures that you get. And I mean, it's like $13 on Amazon or something. This one was 16 on Amazon. But I think it's like 30 in store for some reason. I don't know why. And, um, so yeah. That's, that's really it for showing you the outside of the box and just going over that. Now, it's time to get to the actual toy itself. Okay, so, let me just get these guys in here. You can't see them right now, but... I'll just, let me lower this real quick. Okay, so anyways, you know, you got the two Jackal Freefooters, Freebooters, right here. You know, Jackals have always been not really pleasant to the eye, so I don't really care too much for these guys, but they still have a nice mold. You know, I think they look great. And, um, yeah, you get two of them. Both of them have the same exact everything. They're just, they're the same. They don't have different guns. They don't have different molds, different paint, nothing. They're, they're literally the same. So that's those guys out of the way. And then, you know, here's the Warthog itself. It's got this new suspension feature. And, you know, it's like a Jeep or, you know, just a car. I like to think of it as more like a Jeep. But... You know, it's got like little independent, like it can be independent for each wheel, like an actual, you know, like Jeep or four wheel or whatever. So you can do any wheel, but be careful because if you push up too high, like oh, that was like a mix of the word high and hard. But if you do it like too high, it'll like undo itself kind of, and you'll have to put it back together. I haven't snapped the rubber band in there yet because that's pretty much what you know the whole system is surrounded by or uses to work and um i think you might be able to use a rainbow bloom rubber band but i have no clue i haven't tried it i don't want to break it and see so i'm gonna be careful with that and then as you can see you know it's just it's just a clear windshield Nothing really too special about it. Now, I haven't seen this piece before. It's like a, kind of like a rubbery piece. And it connects to like, you know, like, I don't know, one of these things, like a cylinder kind of. And then they just put it up here and this is supposed to be like an extra light or something. I don't know, like right up here. And you would just put that through the top of where the windshield kind of sits. And then it's got like a little engine right here, kind of for looks. You know, you, you can't really build it, but that's all you get. Like you can't, you know, pull off the hood and look at it. Um, and then, you know, this piece right here kind of pops off. And so that's how that's made. I don't know, it's kind of weird because I was trying to do a stop motion earlier. And like, you know, I was moving it. And then it accidentally popped off. 
because I was trying to do the suspension thing because it was turning. And it comes with three little jerry cans, you know, a little ammunition thing like previous ones. And then, you know, pretty much the turret's the same. The turrets, the wheels, that, that stuff's the same. But a lot of it's different compared to the last ones. So let me pull these guys off real quick so you can take a quick look at them. Alright, so here's the Chief and the Ramin. I mean, what, what did I just try to say? I have no clue. I think I kind of reversed Marine. Like, literally the word Marine. I, I have no clue. But, <laughs> pretty much, this is the Chief and the Marine side by side. So, as you can see, Master Chief, you know, he just... I don't know, he's like, he kind of looks like the other ones, you know, same mold as the uh, other Halo Infinite um, Master Chiefs from like other sets. But, you know, he's got like different paint jobs in each set and stuff. So he's pretty much just a standard one. And then, you know, the Marine, I don't know, it seems like most of them are like, it's kind of different because if you look at the ones from the other sets, like this is the one from Recon Escape. He's got like a beard. It's kind of hard to see it. He's got a beard. This one's got absolutely no facial hair at all. And you know, there's like different skin tones, different genders, all that stuff. So anyways, you know, he's running around with an SMG and you get an SMG in the other set too. So if you really wanted to, you could make Chief run around with the iconic, you know, Halo 2 cover, you know, where he's got like two SMGs, all that stuff. Okay, but anyways, as I was saying earlier, you know, there's this really cool thing about the weapons now, and it's, I don't know, it's crazy. This is both for the SMG and the assault rifle and a couple other guns, but check this out. It's an attachment. Like, they literally made attachments. Tiny pieces. When I first got this, I was like, what is this? It's an ammo counter. So it slides on, and then it slides off. Easy to lose. You better keep that intact. You know, they got, like, suppressors and all this stuff. When I was collecting last time, I had no clue about this. I don't think it was even around. See, it goes on there. It doesn't look right on here, because... You know, it's not the same shade, but yeah, and pretty much, you know, the plasma pistols are the same mold as almost every time. So, like pretty much everything's the same, like most of the weapons, um, besides, you know, a couple of these. Some of them are molded different, some of them have, um, like, different different kind of looks to them I guess like molded with different materials or in a different way like this one I don't have another um what is it uh jackal shield but this one's definitely different it's all marbled and um yeah so you get two of these and then you get these two I had to use one of the stands because I don't know I don't know where I put my other one, but yeah, and then here's the Warthog, you know, it's really nice looking, I love it, you know, I would totally buy it again, I might actually do that, because it's just so good, I like it a lot, I recommend that you guys get it too, you know, I'm going to use it for stop motions and stuff, but that's really that, you know, I'm proud to have this set, I love it, I expect to see more from me soon. I'll see you guys later. Have a wonderful day, night, morning, whatever it is. I hope you have a good time.